I bet you guys are really wondering what's happening with me now. Am I cleared? Am I not cleared? Am I gonna wrestle? Am I not gonna wrestle? I will let you know though, a couple of weeks ago I took MRIs, I did x-rays, I did CT scans and um, unfortunately for Brit, Oh boy. I'm a hundred percent cleared. Whoa. That's big news. That is big news. The emotion taking over Soraya. Soraya obviously. AEW is my house. Overwhelmed. And that is, um, that is even more shockwaves. I'm telling you. Well, is there anything more fickle than an AEW fan? So, you're clear. What, what does that even mean? Do you, do you know how to do this? Do you still know how to do this? You're clear. No, no, no. We aren't clear, Soraya. You have been coming after me since the day you got here. And why is that? I think I know. I think I got it. So let me know if this is clear. I built AEW from the ground up until it became a fortress that wrestlers like you, no, 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 that superstars like you wanted to move into. And I'm damn proud of that. But that pride turns into resentment very quickly when you have the audacity to skip in here and call it your house. Because it's funny, I don't recall you laying a single brick. And I understand, I finally, I get it. I know why you're obsessed with me. It's because I'm everything you wish you could have been. And if you think, if you think I'm lying, if you, if you think that's not true, let me remind you, you left your house and walked into mine. And Soraya, I regret to inform you that we don't take walk-ins, so bitch, make an appointment. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> that was stiff. <laughs> this thing is heating up, man. You know, I think it's really cute you put yourself on a pedestal considering you got handed your position by Tony Khan. You got fed a bunch of QT's trainees. And you've only been in front of the camera for three years, sweetheart. I've been in this business for 30, 17 years professionally. You don't know what it takes to be a superstar. You don't know what it takes to even be a star. I traveled up and down the UK and all over Europe for free because I love this business. I got hit by a car and wrestled the same day because I love this business. I handed out wrestling resumes to promoters and got turned down for the sheer fact that I was female. You have no idea what it takes to make it. Because I was starting revolutions before they were a trend and before wrestling was even a twinkle in your eye. I've done Madison Square Garden, I've done the O2, I've done the Tokyo Dome, and now I'm in front of an ungrateful bitch. You don't know what it takes, Brit. I've been publicly humiliated in front of millions of people. I 
rebelled my drug addiction publicly. I've given my career and my neck for this business. You don't have a clue what it takes to make it. But here you go, Brit. Here's an, another opportunity handed to you on a silver platter. This is gonna be my comeback story, and this is gonna be your biggest match of your career. It's gonna be you versus me at full gear. Oh, whoa! Damn, <laughs> oh, wow! Brit's in shock here. I'm not sure I've ever seen Britt Baker speechless. She's speechless. She has spe <laughs> never seen a speechless. Oh, Britt, try for the cheap shot, Soraya. Uh oh, uh oh. Soraya has Britt up and. Oh, God.